Hey everyone, so all of you or most of you have been asking me what colors are in my hair, what do I do to dye my hair, and also about my haircut. So I'm going to guide you through step-to-step -step things that you can tell your hairstylist if you want to cut your hair the same way or if you just want the layers or the color, stuff like that. So when I get it cut, what I do is I say to keep the length because I really want to grow out my hair. My hair used to be all the way down to here. So I say keep the length, trim about a centimeter off of the hair. Like this would be my longest length. So a centimeter off of that. And um, then create a lot of layers. So my layers, usually she layers it from my jaw line right here so that's my shortest layer um, that frames my face and then the layers up here are pretty like short so when I go back I'm still going to continue getting short layers at the top but keeping the length because I want lots of volume and that's the best way to get volume you just cut a bunch of layers and then your hair kind of like flips out that way and it looks feathered and whatever. So that's how I get my hair cut. Just tell them you want to keep the length but have a lot of um, layers. And it's good to cut your hair about every six weeks to keep your hair really healthy and eat lots of proteins and drink lots of water. That's what I do. And my hair is starting to grow really fast. Like, really fast. Like I just colored my hair and my roots. You can kind of already see them. But okay. The color. Now, lots of you have seen that I had pretty much purple or fuchsia streaks before. But that's right when I dye my hair. And then after, it fades to this um, sort of strawberry color. And then it goes to a blonde. But then some of them, as you can see, is still strawberry red. And then blonde. So this is what I did. The rest of my hair that's pretty much dark, I got my colorist to dye this a, um, a deep plum, so a dark plum. Your base color is always supposed to be darker because your base color will fade. So this has faded a bit, but you always want to go with a deep plum when you're doing this. And then you take box, um, or, yeah, box panels, so really thick sort of highlighted sections that you're going to have. Let's see if I can find some. Like a highlighted section will be pretty much like this much, and then you're going to bleach that. And I know bleaching is bad for your hair, but if you keep your hair really healthy afterwards, it won't be as bad. And if you go with the right volume for your hair. So if you have really fine hair, I think I'm a 10 volume. I think it was a 10 or a 20 volume. So you bleach it. And then after when it's bleached, you're going to take the purple or violet color. And you're going to apply it on all the bleach sections. And um, then you will pretty much apply everywhere else just to give it that extra violet shine. And yeah, and then your stylist will wash it out and it'll be like, bam, violet. And then the base color will be a dark plum. So it'll look almost brown, but has more of a plum. And now they will ask you if you want it more to the ready tone or more to the violet purple tone. I go more to the violet purple tone because I like the purpley tones better. But I really love how it fades because it still looks really nice when it fades. So I get both um, usage out of it. Like uh, I get the purple and then I get the blonde and the strawberry red. So that's what it turned to. And then I swear it looks a little bit pink right here. But that's okay. I'm going to touch it up probably in February. Um, I want to keep an eye on how quick my hair is growing by looking at the roots. So in February I'm going to touch it up. Hopefully my hair will be up to here, I hope. But I hope that was pretty clear for you guys. Um, just tell your stylist you want a deep plum base. 
and you want to add huge panels of violet highlights into your hair and you're gonna have to bleach it before you add the violet so the colors really bam like in your face and then it'll kind of turn into this um but yeah that's all I do and if you have any questions ask me in this video only about my hair like only this video ask me and I will answer the questions in this video but I hope this was pretty clear for you guys so yeah I'll see you guys later bye guys